Welcome from the sleep experts at napping.com. In this video, we're going to discuss BiPAP for central sleep apnea and why to consider a BiPAP machine over a CPAP machine when diagnosed with CSA. What is central sleep apnea? Central sleep apnea is a disorder that affects breathing during sleep, but is different from the more common obstructive sleep apnea. Central sleep apnea is characterized by pauses in breathing during sleep due to the non-activation of respiratory muscles and the brain failing to request the respiratory muscles to activate. This is the difference between obstructive sleep apnea and central sleep apnea. In CSA, there is a lack of communication from the brain to these respiratory muscles. One can in fact have both OSA and CSA, which is known as mixed sleep apnea. When one is diagnosed with central sleep apnea, the decision to treat it is dependent on the individual. If there are no symptoms present, one may decide not to treat and just observe. However, if symptoms are present, then one may decide to go for treatment, one of them being CPAP therapy. Up to 20% of central sleep apnea cases do happen to resolve spontaneously. Some symptoms of CSA include being very tired throughout the day, having trouble concentrating, memory issues, amongst other physical symptoms. It is important to get diagnosed if one suspects they suffer from CSA, as it can be tied to an underlying health condition and if left untreated, could worsen the severity of the symptoms. A diagnosis would often involve an overnight sleep study. And from this study, you would be diagnosed with a CSA and the type of CSA you have. What are some treatment options for central sleep apnea? After being diagnosed with CSA, there may be some treatment suggested by your physician. Your CSA could be from an underlying disease in which treatment to that disease might help your CSA. A reduction in medication or certain medications might be a path for treatment. For most though, BiPAP or bilevel positive airway pressure therapy is something that is recommended by their physician. You may be wondering what is the difference between a CPAP and a BiPAP machine. A CPAP machine can only be set to a single pressure which delivers a continuous stream of pressurized air to stop an apnea event. BiPAPs are different in that they have two pressure settings, one for inhalation and one for lower pressure exhalation. This allows the individual to get more air in and out throughout their sleep session. BiPAPs are often used for those with CSA or for those who went and have tried CPAP but the CPAP therapy was unable to treat them. Individuals diagnosed with CSA tend to find a BiPAP machine much more comfortable than using a CPAP machine that only has one setting. We hope this video has been helpful in understanding why BiPAP is typically assigned when diagnosed with central sleep apnea. Please find resource links in the description to learn more and visit napping.com for the latest news and advice related to sleep apnea and BiPAP equipment. Thanks for watching.